Hello, I'm Dr. Bill Wagoner. Welcome to today's Tuesday Tip. Today, I'd like to talk about New Smile's newest material, Neoliner LC. Neoliner LC is a light cured MTA material that's recommended for use as either a liner or as an indirect pulp capping material. This material is comparable to Theracal LC, but with some enhancements. Neoliner LC comes in a small syringe with disposable tips that allow for precise and easy placement of the material. It has a thick enough viscosity that it doesn't flow all over the preparation, but it will stay in the area where it's placed. It's insoluble and moisture tolerant, and it has a continuous high calcium release. This calcium release, along with a high pH, will promote hydroxyapatite formation. The high pH will also have some bactericidal effects, and its placement can protect against hypersensitivity. Because of the resin in the material, it's compatible with all etching and bonding and resin restorative materials. It's also radiopaque for easy post-operative assessment. Now in these graphs, we can see that Neoliner LC has both a higher flexural and compressive strength than Theracal LC and a much higher calcium release at one week after placement. Neoliner LC is not recommended for direct pulp capping because of the resin component, which can act as an irritant and, as with any resin materials, can damage or kill pulpal tissue if placed in direct contact. If you should have a pulpal exposure, a resin-free MTA material, such as NeoMTA2 or NeoPutty, is recommended as a pulp capping agent due to its exceptional biocompatibility. One final point about NeoLiner LC. If you're doing a resin composite restoration, the NeoLiner LC can be placed either prior to or following etching and bonding. If the preparation appears to be close to the pulp, I would place the Neoliner LC and then etch and bond. However, if I were using the Neoliner LC simply as a liner, I would likely etch and bond and then place the Neoliner LC, followed by the composite resin. Surprisingly, studies have indicated that if a bonding agent is placed first, it does not seem to interfere with the bioactivity of the MTA. Neoliner LC is now available from New Smile. I would recommend that you try a syringe and see what you think. And please give us your feedback. Thanks for listening. I'll see you next time.